create this hungry curl game. So here we have a curl and we have some objects. So she is very hungry so she want to eat. So we are going to make her eat these food items and more the items we make her eat and then we give even the cake. So like we have to move with the left arrow and the right arrow so as soon as I move so as soon as I move I have to show the so when I actually run and when I press right so I can see so the goal is moving isn't it left right left right so then when she eats the corn what we can see some sound is coming as well as she is eating it and the score has also increased when she eats the apple, some sound is coming here. The score has increased. Now, when she eats the fries, then she has eaten the score has increased. Plus, it's showing that my stomach is good. So, we are going to create this type of game today. So, we will go to code.org. We create a new game lab project. Then we are adding animation. American fries. Then what we can have next is we can have a donut, or we can simply have corn. Then we're going to go first mini map project to hungry girl game. Then what we can do need to give you zooming for you so that you are able to see it clearly. So what we are doing there first is the very dragon component is very able to right. Let me zoom in more so that you are able to see it clearly. But I wanted to see the it clearly. So variable what we can do is variable curl. Here it will create sprite. If you want me, I will show blocks also. Plus, if you want me to code from the next video, then you can definitely tell me and convey this message to me via comment section. So, from the next video onwards, I'm going to do in code only, but I think that this is more convenient to you because this will actually and help you to get clear code but still if you want me to create it to code then of course you can just comment it then I'm sure we're gonna show here so I mean we need the first broad space when I run again we can see the ball has been created but isn't it she's so so too smart what we can do is we can scale her girl dot scale is equal to Zero point five. I have written it wrong. You can just write zero point five. So when I raise it and run, now you can see it's not good. We can add one more variable that is travel. But we have to put this background before the curl. What happens is the background will actually cover. I mean, if we do that, the girl will be forced 
then the girl will actually the girl will actually what will happen the girl would be drawn first then background would be drawn so the girl would be hidden by the background so that is why we are going to put background first i hope that pretty clear so then what are we going to do next is we are going to set animation background dot set animation is equal to we can choose we can actually choose a background we can just write that desk and it's gonna come there so background is equal to we just do it here changes and when I'm going to run you can see she has done but I don't want her to be there so I'm going to put in a position 170 and 170 and 250 so when I will reset and run well, I mean, not there too, so I will put it 163 hand. So, farewell, it's all good. So we can actually add three food items here. Then you can actually do in this animation. So we can have the apple somewhat here. So 360 and 250 would be perfect according to me. 360 and what about that? 260. 360 and 260. That's all according to me. You can do it any way you want. When I raise it and run. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. I can just can't say anything right now. Because you want to know why I can't say anything right now. We need to scale it first. We need to scale it first. Okay, need to scale it first. Oh, we are just going to, I mean, learn a video even words to say what. So, I mean, so when I read it and run, now it's little clear, but still zero point two one would be um zero point one five. What do you think? It's all according to you. What you think? When I reset and run, and it's actually fine. I can have it somewhat with little time. So instead of 260, I can have it 270. Now it's clear. You no, know, there's two the corner. You need to reset it. See. Here also 0 0.15. I need to put it ready. When I reach it and run, it's good. Corn, I can just keep it somewhat here. 2, 220.
and I mean it's gone there so we can have it 25 it's gold now here we can have 280 250 so now we can use it in one now it's good so now what we can next do is we are going to add an if statement that if key down is up key down is equal to left then what's going to happen girls x position is going to change girls x position is going to change to Girl dot x minus b. Now same we can copy. And here we can do write. Go to show text and do it plus. So let's just see if it's going. Yes, the call is more or five. Now we can add more if statements. So next what we can do is if girl is touching girl is touching apple then apple is going to be destroyed. Then you can actually just copy it and then we will write here if girl is touching price and if Let us see. Yes, she is eating. Fine. Next, what we can do is we can have a sound. So we can here search for crunch Just remove these blocks So next what we can do is we can create a new variable score so what we can do is when it's using any of these the score is going to increase by one so we can just copy it three times then we can put it in the required position. Then we want this code, like if it just this code is good, but it's not getting implemented to us. So for that we need to put it. So we're going to add text. After draw strikes, then we have to write.
you can increase the text font, not text font, but the text size to 20. Position you can give 46, 18. Run. So, yeah, it's coming fine. Then we'll add one more text. But it will going this text will only come with, with the if statement that if that if code is actually equal to three, then this text will show that is. My stomach is now we can run and two score two no score. So it's showing my stomach is full. So we can add exclamatory mark here and our game and our game is all done.